so much fun because they're party animals now. Because they're funding their dreams. You know why? Because we have some incredible stories. Some of these young men and young ladies up here are doing thirty, forty thousand dollars a week. When they talk about TLC, you tell them to go to hell. Because we are significantly impacting our communities and our young. Right? So what I want to do first. I want to bring up the first person. Y'all going to cue me up? Mr. Daryl Dre, give it up! So I'm gonna start here. How many of you guys are interested in earning a six-figure ring in total life changes? Good, good, good. But first, I must educate your expectations on this journey. Uh, <laughs> it's kind of ironic how most of us up here, prior to us changing, we had army fatigue on. And I was in the back talking to Mr. Lloyd. And I said, how ironic is that? Seven years ago, I started with seven of my friends. Seven years later, all seven of my friends quit. And seven years ago, our goal was to make seven figures in this industry. And the only thing that separated us, or I'm sorry, myself from them, was that I stayed in line. <laughs> and I don't, think, I don't think you guys fully understand the power of staying in line. So right now, Mr. Lord, I'm gonna to talk to the 30 and under. Because sometimes I think we're, we're, we're so conditioned to be in a microwave society to where we want things instant, but we don't. But we don't want to. We don't want to give anything, you know. And, and it's kind of funny. I was talking to Mr. Lloyd, and um, <laughs> and and he was saying, you know, what do you think separates you from your friends back then? And the main thing I think that separated me from them is that I had to compromise. I knew that I had a decision to make. And that decision was, am I gonna hang out and party or am I going to buckle down and create a future for my family? Now again, I'm talking to the serious people under 30. If you're just here to have fun, I'm not talking to you right now. Now, on this journey, you have to make sure that you do not allow perfect to get in the way. Because you're not gonna be perfect. You're gonna fail. And TLC is not telling you to join TLC, you're not gonna fail. What we're telling you is, you join TLC, and when you fall, you're gonna have somebody right there to help you get up. What we're telling you, it's not gonna be easy, but what we're telling you is gonna be worth it. Because the seven year plan that they have for me, attend that university, <laughs> that seven year plan that they have for me, Go to school for four years, then turn around and spend another three years to try to get a job? Exactly. That was not what I wanted to do. So, before I get too passionate, now if I say something <laughs> to offend you guys tonight, just know it wasn't for you, it was meant for the person next to you. <laughs> now wrapping this up guys, the main thing I want you, I want everyone to take from this, and now I'm talking to everybody, because we all fall victim of procrastination. Everybody wants to know, how do you get to six figures? How do you get to a million dollars? And it's not necessarily what you need to know or what you need to do more of. A lot of times it's what you need to let go of and who you need to let go of. And that was my biggest thing. So going forward, I'm not asking you guys 
to heck. Maybe I am asking you guys to jump all the way in because I like to use this analogy. I got 60 more seconds. You know, when I first got started in this industry, I kind of looked at this industry like, you know, maybe two kids at the pool. You have one kid at the pool, right? And, and he goes to the pool and he kind of like dips his toe in. It's cold, right? And she's like, get in. And then, he, you know, one foot and, and then the next foot. But it's at, antagonizing every step of the way. But then you have this other type of kid. Some of you have these children. <laughs> Mom, watch this. <laughs> Boom. And he jumps in the water. And it's cold for him too. But after about seven or eight seconds, it starts to get more comfortable. You understand me? He starts going director. He starts going regional. He starts going national. So, what I say is, don't look for this to be comfortable, because it won't. Six figures is uncomfortable every step of the way. But when you can look, when you can say, I may have tripped, I may have stumbled, I may have ran out of teeth. Uh, people, may have, people may have joined me, people may have quit. But when you can stand up here and say, Mom, I did it, Dad, I did it, the team, we did it. So don't fall victim. Don't be like my, my seven friends in 2007 that said we're a team, we're an army, we're going to the top, and then seven years later, I stand up here with my $250,000 ring with all new friends, and now I look back and the world has beat them up. And even though we were in war, they fell victim to the outside attacks. But I know me and my 30 and other crew, we taking this company to the top. So, Thank you guys so much. TLC, come get your ring. It's waiting for you. Mr. J.L. Drake, our music, please, our music. The next person, 30 and under, is somebody you know that I've really got the chance to know. This young lady is a dynamo. She has a heart of gold, very emotional, because she's so serious about what she's doing for so many people. I'd like to... Have come up here and grace the stage. Miss Bonita Lee!
answered that call and I listened to her. You know what? Because she's always been a mentor to me. I saw how she was raising her children, how she wanted more out of life. I saw the people she was surrounding herself with. I wanted to be like them. Ooh, thank you, Denise and Betty, for calling me. I said yes to TLC. You know why? Because I believe Denise. She said, baby, we go all the way to the top. I said, you sure? She said, we go all the way. I believe that I said yes to TLC. Ever since I said yes to TLC, only nine months ago, my life changed. My life changed. You know why I changed? Because I started to notice a compound effect. I started to notice if I didn't make a change, we were gonna, we were gonna go, we were gonna have to go bankruptcy. All of this before I was 30 years old. Almost a hundred thousand dollars in debt. All of this before I was 30. Couldn't afford a Christmas for my kids. So I said yes to TLC because I wanted to change. <coughs> Ever since I said yes to TLC, two years ago, we couldn't even afford to go to the movies. We was watching bootlegs. Y'all know what bootlegs are, right? <laughs> my kids wanted to see Frozen. I couldn't afford for all three of them to get a ticket in, my husband and I, so we watched the bootleg. I turned the lights down, had popcorn. Right, but it still wasn't the same. Because of TLC, when Frozen 2 came out, my kids wanted to go to the movies. I was excited. I said, we can really go see Frozen 2 on a big screen. Y'all can get your own popcorn. But then I got this check in the bill. I got this nice check. I just hit national. I remember. It was $16,000 for a week.